Welcome to our tech troubleshooting video. Today, we're addressing a peculiar issue that many iOS developers have encountered. Our viewer has noticed a frustrating bug in Safari on iOS 10.3.1. When the virtual keyboard pops up, there's an unexpected gap between the HTML elements and the keyboard itself. This gap only appears when you scroll up while the keyboard is active, leaving an unsightly space that can disrupt the user experience. Let's dive into the details and explore how to fix this margin bottom bug in Safari. All right, guys, welcome back to another tech video. Today, we're gonna to be going through your question, answering it, and hopefully finding that solution for you. Now, don't forget to stay just a little bit crazy like me, and hopefully you'll get to that resolution. Anyway, on to the video. Cheers. To address the HTML margin bottom bug in Safari on iOS 10.3.1, we first need to understand the issue. When the virtual keyboard appears, scrolling the page can create an unwanted gap between the HTML element and the keyboard. One effective solution is to adjust the CSS properties of the affected HTML elements. We can use the padding bottom property to ensure that the content does not get obscured by the keyboard. Additionally, we can implement a JavaScript function that detects when the keyboard is shown and automatically scrolls the page to ensure the content is visible. Finally, test your changes thoroughly. Make sure to check the behavior on different devices and orientations to ensure a consistent user experience. Let's now look at a user-suggested answer. To fix the HTML margin bottom bug in Safari on iOS 10.3.1, check your CSS. The issue may be due to using 100% height instead of 100VH for your main view container. Let's now look at another user-suggested answer. To fix the HTML margin bottom bug in Safari on iOS 10.3.1, you can use two CSS properties. First, set the min height to 100VH. Then, add min height with the value WebKit Fill Available. This will ensure the element fills the screen properly. For more details on this hack, you can check out the link provided in the description. Let's now look at another user-suggested answer. To fix the HTML margin bottom bug in Safari on iOS 10.3.1, one user encountered a similar issue with a canvas element. They resolved it by setting the canvas to display as a block. If you're experiencing white space under your canvas when scrolling, try changing the display property to block. This simple adjustment may solve the problem. Let's now look at another user-suggested answer.
if you're experiencing a blank space when scrolling in Safari on iOS 10.31, here's a quick fix. A user found a helpful solution from Chris Coyier's blog. Let's now look at another user-suggested answer. To fix the HTML margin bottom bug in Safari on iOS 10.31, consider using a library like Bootstrap. You can easily set the vertical height to 100. And that's it. I hope this video has helped you get through to that resolution that you're looking for. If it did, please hit subscribe. And until next time you need technical help, I hope you have a good one. Cheers. Cheers.